In this video, we will be discussing how to combine reciprocal EMG triggered stimulation with the Sabo Reach. To begin, you will apply two stimulation electrodes to the tricep muscles. And as a reminder, with the RETS program, channel A will be for the stimulation, which is two electrodes, and channel B will be for biofeedback, which will consist of three EMG electrodes. Next, turn on the device and increase the current being delivered to the triceps until you reach a suitable contraction. Once you are pleased with the current being delivered to the tricep muscles, next we will focus on the biceps. As a reminder with EMG, you're going to have three EMG electrodes for the biceps. You'll have a yellow and a blue, which can be either proximal or distal, and you'll have a black electrode, which is a ground or a reference that can be placed anywhere on the arm. To confirm proper EMG electrode placement, turn on the device and select the EMG assessment mode and have the patient repeatedly bend the elbow to fire the muscles. If you see a good quality signal for the biceps, then the placement should be sufficient. To minimize electrode migration, consider using Coban wrap or something similar before applying the above elbow cuff. Once you apply the above elbow cuff, turn the stimulation on to stimulate the triceps as well as set the activation and deactivation thresholds for the biceps. And then you'll test to make sure the patient can exceed the activation threshold and then relax the elbow to fall below the deactivation threshold. See here, the patient's going to grasp the ball off the table and bring it to his mouth, activating his biceps, which exceeds the activation threshold. Then he'll relax his biceps to fall below the deactivation threshold, then receive stimulation to the triceps.